All right, guys, what's up? So uh, first things first, uh, I've got my iPhone running iOS 7. Let's see if you can see that. Anyway, uh, here we go with uh, iOS 7. Uh, it's clearly iOS 7. Uh, go to Settings, General, About. If you look there, uh, version 7.0. Anyway, regardless, uh, I'm going to show you guys how to go down to 6.1.4 if you're on an iPhone 5, 6.1.3 if you're on anything else. Anyway, you're going to go to this website, felixbruns.de backslash iPod backslash firmware. I'll put that link in the description. Uh, anyway, what you're going to do is you're going to go to this drop list. You're going to find your corresponding firmware. Now, let me reiterate, CDMA is Verizon and Sprint. GSM is AT&T and T-Mobile. So you're going to find your firmwares. Here are the, the iPhone 4s, 4S. Uh, here are the iPod Touches. Anyway, so I found my iPhone 5 6.1.4 firmware. Click that. Click download. It downloads. Here it is. Anyway, we don't need Safari any longer. Next step is to put your phone into DFU mode. Now, this is for anyone with anything wrong with their phone, whether it be iMessaging not working, anything not updating, it being buggy, you don't like it, battery life, whatever it should be, this is how you get back to iOS 6. So, first things first, you are going to hold the home and power button together for exactly 10 seconds. Okay, so here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, five six seven eight nine ten now let go of the power button and continue to hold home and you'll notice that iTunes will recognize the device as recovery mode bingo so where you got it in recovery mode you hit OK on restore iPhone you go to your desktop you click your firmware that you want which is 6.1.4 you hit open you hit restore now before this happens, anything you have backed up on iOS 7 will not work so before. So I'm sorry, you will lose your text messaging, you will lose your pictures, your apps that you've downloaded, you will lose any text message calling, whatever it should be, you will lose everything. So hopefully you have a backup on 6.1.4. Anyway, hit restore, and uh, I will speed up this whole process with... Uh, Final Cut Pro. Alright, so now we've got it back to recovery settings. You hit OK, give it a second. It will restart and we will be back on iOS 6.1.4. I'll verify that for you. Um, thanks for watching, guys. If my phone number showed up, you guys can have it. You guys can text me. Please don't call me at 4 in the morning. Um, I do that out of respect. I appreciate anybody calling, texting me, looking for answers. I do do this for a bit of a living. I mean, I don't make a living, but I do make a lot of money on the side, which helps me really take care of you know things like my bills or my girlfriend. So uh, anyway, uh, here we go. Alright, so if that's not enough proof for you, go into general about, and we got 6.1.4. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Um, please follow me on Twitter at uh, it's me, A and W, uh, and go to my website, which is uh, ijbupdates.com, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks a lot, guys.